Welcome to Drone Patron, not just drums. Patron here with an FPV project. Well, welcome back. And our FPV project is going to be on the UMX Timber. First, we went with the Tundra tires and it flew great. Then we went with the floats and that was fantastic. And I think now we're going to go with FPV. Now here I have a micro camera with a built-in VTX. A 1S LiPo. And a spare hatch for the UMX timber. We're going to put this together and see if we can do FPV with it. Oh, and uh, by the way, if you plan on flying FPV with floats like I do, then I recommend you use silicone modified conformal coating. You brush this on and it waterproofs electronics. I'll put a link in the description where to find this. On these uh, micro cameras with built-in VTXs, you could, if you have a 3D printer, print a base for it or you can purchase them as well. I'll leave, it, I'll leave a link to that. What you're gonna wanna do is Drill a small hole using a 1 8 inch drill bit right where the power leads of the VTX come through. Then you'll want to feed your wires through there. Grab your trusted melt glue gun. And tack it on to the base. And once you've tacked it on, it'll look something like this. If you don't have a hot milk glue gun, you can also use Foam Safe CA and a little kicker. It'll work great. Now, under the hatch, you'll notice there's a raised area right in the center here about the shape of, uh, of a nickel, you're going to want to trim that flush and flat as best you can with a hobby knife. Once you've gotten that, it should look something like that. Pretty flush. Right. In this area here, this is where the 1S LiPo will be mounted. It's going to power the camera and VTX. So 
So on this one is LiPo. It has a micro low C connector. And I'm going to attach the other end, another micro low C connector to it to match the battery. Solder them together. Now they cool off. Just put the excess. And you're going to do the same for the other wire. Uh, next step is. I like to use these command strips. These are the smallest command strips. They're called the minis. Or they're also called frame stabilizer strips. I'll leave a link uh, where to get them. With your camera, VTX installed, and your battery installed, it should be pretty good to go here. Let's see. All right, let's get our FPV monitors. Well, it looks like the camera and video transmitter are working. We're going to have to try this at the field. Hey, right, welcome back. We're here at the flying field with our FPV setup. Let's see how she flies. <laughs> 